Yo, what's going on and welcome back to some more Diablo 4. In the last one, we made it to this first town, Kiyoshad. Kiyovashad, that one. Yeah, there we go. Um, today is a new day. Um, it turns out there was actually a queue to get into the game today, so maybe not as many people were playing. I guess I was playing kind of midday yesterday and it was a Friday, so... Um, makes sense that maybe less people were available today there seemed to be more people so there was, it took a little bit of time just a few minutes to get into the game um it's still early access so i imagine it will get worse when the game actually comes out so hopefully we can get a lot of work done this weekend huh go ahead start the this other quest as well training night and day they deserve a little praise but i can't let them see me as soft Mind giving them a cheer for me? Easy coin for you, a boost of confidence for the recruits, and I get to go on being the hard ass. Everybody wins. Leave it to me. Alrighty. How exactly do we do this? Emo wheel. What am I supposed to do? Hello. Is there a cheer? Oh, there it is. Oh, well done. Thanks. I hope they don't get used to it. G Willigers. I don't know what any of that means, but I got XP and money. Noise. Okay, um, how do I, how do I, like, look at the quests we have on controller? Like, I get that the menu's over there, and I could just pull out my mouse. No, 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 don't do that one. Not in town. Uh. <laughs> I, what is this? Herb cash. Am I supposed to use this? Oh, Jesus. Okay, it just had, like, materials and stuff in it. Oh, wait, no, I think I saw it. Quest. No, those are quest items. How the heck on controller do you... gotta be in here then right this okay so we're currently tracking this other side quest which i guess we will do and then we'll get back to the main quest afterwards okay so we have to actually go to that menu of the map but i can't help but notice that this doesn't seem right we're supposed to be up there Well, I guess we're here. Let's do this part of the quest. I'm sure it'll tell us to go somewhere similar to the side quest. We were born in sin. Children of darkness. But the Father's light can be sought through penitence and faith. Walk in the light. We must be ever vigilant against sin, brother. Yes, Reverend Mother. Let the light of Inarius burn away wickedness. Let not temptation lead you from his holy radiance. Let righteousness sear away corruption and sin. Cast out thy darkness, for only light must remain. Cast out thine darkness, for only light must remain. Is this the one from Nevest? Yes, Reverend Mother. Did Lorath not accompany you? He sent me on without him. Putting faith in that old man was a mistake. What could possibly be of greater import? Lilith. So, you know. Hmm. We have received word from one of our knights of a demon sighting in Gale Valley. The description matches too closely to the sighting in Nevesk. 
If you would travel to Yelesna and take stock of events there, you would have the gratitude of the Cathedral of Light. I had thought to send Lorath, but... Again, he fails in his duty. With or without Lorath, the will of Inarius shall be done. Here, take the Knight's report before you go. Did I get it? I don't know. Reverend Mother, oh, no, that I was received it. a report of a potential demon sighting. Horned woman near Yelesna Mines. Performed routine inspection, nothing yet. Sent in priest and escort of knights. We'll report in when we find something. Um, the other thing that I wanted to mention, I'm sure that maybe this is obvious for some people. Um, but I feel like uh, Lorath last time was talking about how that one angel dude, I don't even know what, I don't remember what the angel's name was. Uh, how the angel walks among the people. I am pretty sure that Lorath has to be that angel dude, right? Because he was very sure. So he's either obviously met the angel guy or he is him. And he was very sure about um, that guy's existence. Not only that, but he kind of said like some weird stuff like uh, the angel dude and Lilith are enemies, mortal enemies, and they'll drag the entire world into their feud. Um, so like... Only someone with great insight into the situation would say something like that. Plus, I think there was a... When I was looking up thumbnails for this game, there was one picture of an angel... Like, a guy with the angel wings from Diablo. And he had, like, a... A kind of polearm lance thing which looked very similar to the polearm lance that we went and got for Laura. So I'm pretty sure it's him based off of those things. I can't do that here. Oh, we're still in town. All right. Okay, now we're out of town. So the main quest is like right here. Oh, no, it's an event. Sure, we'll go do an event. <laughs> Okay, these guys hurt a little bit more than other things we've run into. Sure, I just have to keep stopping the guy who's like walking towards this thing. I don't do very much damage though as a problem. I'm not ready yet. Oh Jesus. Well, this is bad. I'm not ready yet. I'm slowed. I got a challenge for killing a whole bunch of stuff very quickly. Whoa! Okay, we killed everything. We're so good at the game. Yeah, definitely, I was thinking that uh, by going the the knife that kind of bounces off of things, that we'd have a little bit more crowd control. We do not have a lot of crowd control, so. Um, we might want to experiment with some other things that may or may not have better crowd control. 
I guess when I was first picking things, I didn't really get what this ability did. It does a lot of damage, very good against the bosses. Wait, we can get stuff for other classes? Why? But yeah, it's very good against the bosses, but um, not really that useful when it comes to a whole bunch of enemies. We got one more point. We can get to here now. So what are we looking at here? Become unstoppable and quickly move through the shadows to stab your victim from behind. Gain 50 movement speed. What are these passives? They're knocking back or knocking down an enemy. Okay, I don't have that. Your evade cooldown is reduced. And then we daze an enemy, so we'd have to be able to daze someone. Weapon type. Okay, so currently we're using daggers, I think, so we'd get... The healthy enemies is above 80%. Is that what it said last time? Caltrops. Leap backwards. Go Caltrops. That seems pretty good, actually. Dash forward and slash enemies. Kind of feel like we go with this Caltrops thing, because it gives us a second dash, essentially. What are the upgrades? Enemies take 3% increased damage from you each second they are in Caltrops. That seems pretty good. Caltrops now deals cold damage and chills enemies. I don't know what that means, but sure. <clears throat> I feel like the cold Caltrops seem pretty good. Okay, so this has given us... How do I skill assignment. Oh, okay, okay. So if I happen to have two skills unlocked, this is how I pick which skill I can use. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, does this have multiple charges? Oh, that's a lot bigger than I thought it was. It's pretty good. Oh, this event respawns? Events respawn pretty quickly, huh? The daughter of hatred demands um, we'll do it one more time because I think there's something for... Um... I think there's something for doing three events, and this would be our third one. I'm not ready yet. I feel like we do less damage. Is that because someone else is helping us here? I'm not ready yet. I need more time. Will be pleased. A demon heart. I don't know what those ovals do. Oh, okay, we're fully healed. I forgot that the potions heal over time. So you could have two stacks of the Caltrops. That actually makes them really good. Yeah, we have some buff. I think it was making us do, or maybe making the enemies have more health, but we had like people nearby helping us. So we're supposed to investigate the road. Oh, the Caltrops work on flying enemies? That's kind of funny. Okay, we're getting a little bit of stuttering with certain 
things that we do, but I think it's only the first time that we do them. So don't we have a mount? I thought we got a mount. Oh, I also realized that once you apply like your transmogs, it covers up all gear. Um, no matter what, if you change it to something else. I saw that in the menus when I was logging out last time. But how, like... Is there a controls section? How do I use my mount? Mount is right. Okay, well we don't have one then. It doesn't work. Where are we going? This is not gonna help us do the quest. <laughs> I heard ominous noises, so I wanted to see what was over here. Alright, it just seems like other enemies, not like a cool boss or anything. Oh, I thought that was something. better than what we have oh found him. indeed I am my guard turned on me tried to choke the life out of me all I could do before I lost consciousness was go over the cliff I need to return to Kuyovashad and request a night escort please take the tithing demands to the merchant lord Talgun in Menestad Where's that at? Oh, that's not that far away. We sure we can't help you? I feel like you're gonna die out here, but you do you. So I, I still throw, even though I have a short sword now. Many lads have been lost to the, this canyon. Some say vampires lurk in the shadows. Well, that's not ominous at all. Okay, we should get this waypoint. Also, we should probably salvage stuff while we're here. I am so very grateful. I will need to make the necessary arrangements. Please, excuse me. How did this happen? I shouldn't be holding this in my hands. It should be. <laughs> An arrangement I made went awry, and I was extorted by the ruffian Laskus for protection. He's camped somewhere near the pass to the northwest. Return the gemstones he stole, and I'll make it worth your while. Okay, so let's sell some stuff. Something for the cold and dark.
I guess some of these things are a little bit better, not that we have that much money, but... Anything breaks, the forge is hot. What does this have? Good garbage. Alright, I don't know what that is. Uh, do I keep the dagger, I guess? I don't really know what the difference between the dagger and the short sword. Like, do I use them for the same stuff? I'll keep the dagger for now. Probably don't need this. Salvage. Um, so where are we supposed to go? Here. Let's stop by the stable and see if we can figure out how to get a mount. Don't really understand that part yet. the heck? Oh, the enemy's out there. I was like, why is there an enemy right here? So do I not have these mounts? I can't get over to the vendor menu. Like to shine on you. But maybe I'm just not allowed to have a mount yet. See what this is event is. There? Do you need help? Dark all around. Why did mother go? I don't want to be alone. Having all these dashes is not very good for staying inside the, the little area. Well, that was exciting. It's kind of fun to just have those random events that anyone can do with each other.
Yeah, those seem a lot better than what we have. Merchant. Ha! This will cost him dearly. How do I get this? It's locked. You know, whispering key. I like how the, the ricocheting knives bounce off of destructibles to other destructibles. <laughs> okay, I don't see this key anywhere. Um, does this take any? No. Do you have to like set a home base that that down teleports you to? I don't really know how that works. But we can just teleport from the map, so I guess it doesn't matter that much. So, the deed is done. Excellent. I knew you would prove worthy of my trust. I'm sure you've heard the new word as it spreads. We will no longer suffer at the hands of the lesser. Our strength, our might, our destiny is to triumph over the weak. Okay. I can go back through this teleporter. Um, where am I supposed to be going for the main quest now? Track. Oh, I'm supposed to go the complete other direction? Alright, well... <laughs> Yeah, that didn't really teach us about uh, gemstones and stuff. The reason that I thought it might was because I think it said like a cold enchanted gemstone. I was like, oh, maybe we'll get to like keep it or he'll tell us how it works or something. Um, should we experiment? Oh, we always get these whenever we do a quest. Should we experiment with a different type of auto attack? I also feel like maybe we should switch this. Should I just reset the whole thing? I think we'll reset everything. Oh, oh, it costs eight gold. Yeah, that seems acceptable. Okay, um, I want to try a melee one. Damaging a crowd controlled or injured enemy increases its. Okay.
I don't really know what lucky hit chance is. Maybe just crit. Hitting an enemy while you are below 50% energy makes them vulnerable. Okay, so you want to like spam skills and then hit them with this? Or injured enemy. So if they're below 35% health. I think I'm gonna do this one. Seems like you wanna like spam skills with it. Let's try this. Need to use two more skills. Healed for 1% of your maximum life. How do I make people vulnerable though? I don't really have vulnerable in my build. That is dash. I have one point left. Twenty percent increased critical strike damage. I don't really have a lot of crit though. I don't have the ability to daze people either, I don't think. Should probably just upgrade something to be better. How much do we get out of this? We get two damage. This gives us five damage. And I feel like we want to be spamming this because we want to get below 50% energy and then hit people to get our energy back. Maybe could have gotten one of these actually. What is this shop over here, anyways? It's like, this shady vendor gives you a small chance to obtain a valuable item in exchange for murmuring ovals. Ovals can be found by completing events throughout the sanctuary. Okay. How do I know how many of these I have? Oh, 95, okay. Interesting. I don't, ooh, a whispering key. Purveyors of curiosity. Do I want to just bring one of these with me at all times? I'm gonna buy one. Because we did find that whispering chest, but we couldn't open it. I'm not gonna go back there. Oh, that's not the way to go. Um, but the next time we find a whispering or a silent chest or whatever, we'll be able to get there. This seems like it'll give us more crowd control. Dash seems pretty useful as well, because I assume we'll be able to dash through enemies. That was a quest down here. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Okay, I gotta get used to what buttons are what. far in the other direction. What is this? Light watch. It says sorcerer only. What does that mean? Is it a, a 
dungeon for sorcerers only, or is it a dungeon where sorcerers get a special effect? Hey, we saved this random dude. He doesn't seem to care that we saved him, though. New cool stuff. No, not really. There's a big event up here. Guess we'll go join it with this guy. What are we supposed to do to kill the enemy? Maybe it's just because this other guy's around, but it doesn't seem like we're doing that much damage. What does this area do? Okay, what kind of... We need three more points till we can get to the next thing. Reduces the cooldown. Buffs the damage. Should maybe get a buff to it. Enemies damage by dash take 20%. That would be good if we could crit. I don't know how reliably we could crit. So we're trying to get down here. I don't know if I should do this dungeon thing or not. Gives you this aspect thing. It's only for sorcerers. Can I, if I made a sorcerer, does that sorcerer get it automatically, or do I have to do it again? Don't really know how this works. Let's check it out. Might as well. We could try and learn what these things actually are.
very foggy here. Supposed to kill these guys? I guess so. Also, am I healing for one HP when I break these destructibles? difficult our build is not working as well as I would have liked Oh jeez, that was tricky water. I thought we were safe here. Oh, those guys aren't targetable yet. Oh, I didn't see you. They're invisible, that's why I didn't see them. So which numbers are lucky strike? We seem to have yellow numbers and we seem to have blue numbers. Thank you, Wanderer. Without you, I'd be dead. I think I can manage from here. Please, take this. Apparently that survivor can die. Okay, we got a ring. Which we don't have a ring yet, so I feel like that's just a positive. This bow is much better than what we have. Well, let's explore, because I don't think we can go through this way yet. It's locked. Yeah. Gotta find the key. I guess we go in here. I need more time. Oh, uh, my dad was not ready. That's a problem. Oh, that barrel doesn't explode? Of course it doesn't.
Yeah, of course the one time I try and kite people through a barrel, uh, I hit a non-explosive barrel. It kind of seems like I'm just using our ability as a basic attack at this point. Oh, hello. Okay, so that's how we get the stun. We just gotta do the evade through someone. And then the next Is it true what they say? thing stuns. An angel walks among men? Oh. The knights march to Corvallis. If I were two years older, I'd have passed my trials and I'd be marching with them. Instead, I stay. The skeleton crew will guard the fort until the knights can return. You'd be proud. No more polishing shields for me. They gave me a sword. Though I doubt you will ever see battle. I'll write soon. Edmund. I mean, I don't really know where to look for the key. Explored most of this left side. Might as well just drink that. Well, off to the other side then. Good gear. Staggers better. Should I go with these pants? Oh, it's from distant enemies. Yeah, that 19 armor is probably more effective then. Yeah, we got a lot more movement options, which is nice. I'm not sure that this auto attack is good at all. Oh, okay. Everyone's dead. This guy died standing up, and he remains standing up. Alright, what else can we get here? Dealing damage to crowd-controlled enemies. Reduces its cooldown. Okay, that would give us the opportunity to daze, but I don't think we have slow. At least it now slows them. I think the other one we just couldn't do. We just don't have it in our build yet. Oh! Yeah. I saw that a little bit too late. Oh, there's a boss in here. Nice. Got the stun there. 
care about doing that. Low on energy. Okay. I'm not ready yet. I didn't realize there was another boss. Okay, we got a key. I think we still clear this side. Oh, hello. You're like a mini boss. Okay, we need to do that more or dash through them. The problem is, is we can only use our dodge dash, not our other dash. means that's not good all right this seems to be working decently though okay that's an explosive barrel Yeah, the fact that we can move around the battlefield a lot more seems to be helping. Oh! I stepped on another one of those. I didn't see that one, though. Oh, hello. Sorry to interrupt your party. Hey, we got another ring. Doesn't really help us with anything, but we... Don't have anything else to do with that ring slot right now, so. build seems at least a lot more interactive than what we were doing before. So I just like dash around everywhere, spam a whole bunch of buttons. Got to kill that rat. Oh! <laughs> I was not looking at the screen. I, I looked away to look at the recording because I was like, oh, we're just opening a door. What could possibly happen while we're opening a door? Apparently that. That can happen while you're opening a door. supposed to be doing? I haven't met any enemies for a while. Oh, this seems like a boss room. Okay. Do a little bit of kiting, I guess. What is the Blood Wolf? Is that... I assume that's not an ally. <laughs> I think that's maybe just a buff that that guy has. Alright, well, I mean, that was kind of scary, but we, we did fine. Oh, that's a trap. Oh, they don't step on the trap? Yet. 
what is that? Okay, well, it's gone then. <laughs> we just walk into this room and there's a single uh, crossbowman. We break these, we can. I didn't mean to open the chest, I meant to kill that guy. So we have to dash through people I need time to do that. if we want to get that stun. Okie dokie. I guess we go up to this buff up here. Oh, come on. It's like makes explosions. That seems pretty cool. Probably should have grabbed this first in hindsight. But... And it's gone. It also made us run faster. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? I'd like to go back to town after this dungeon. Yeah, it seems a lot better than what we currently have, at least. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. I need time to do that. There's a lot of enemies that just kind of appear while you're doing stuff, huh? The closer we to the end of this thing, 
This takes a lot longer than I expected. I don't really need that, I don't think. Uh, I don't know what the right way is, so I'm gonna go this way first, because I think it's the right way. Well, I suppose since we have two charges on our dash, we can get the double of the effect for them already being slowed by just slowing them with the dash first, right? That makes sense. Well, this seems like an ominous room. Oh, hello. Oh, you don't get stunned, okay. Oh, you also hurt a lot. I'm not ready yet. Oh, that's that's a lot of nonsense. Ow. Oh, you're just really fast as well. I don't know if I could beat this guy. He's really fast and tough. Ow. That's okay, at least he gave me a health potion. Him? Oh, he didn't give me another health potion. I kind of wanted another health potion there. We need to get up his stun again. Okay, at least I got- Oh, hello. Oh, they're invisible. I need more time. Oh, he's gone apparently. This potion. Okay, that's great news. Oh, that's not good. I need that potion. Okay, hello. Okay, oh my gosh. Good, we unlocked this that I did we can't use. How do I claim this? Uh I can't claim it. I see, I see. Well, I assume that now if we have a, a sorcerer, we can just use that. That was pretty tough um, to solo here. How do I leave? Exit a dungeon at any time. For opening the action wheel. Dungeon entrance. You can either go like this. Or you can go like this. Go leave dungeon. Okay. That didn't work how I wanted it to. Okay, you do that. I was holding up so I immediately walked out of being able to exit. Oh, hello. I need more 
time. Ow. Where do these enemies all keep coming from? I just wanted to teleport out of here. How? Oh, that's not the map. What is this? Sure, I think. Seems pretty cool. Okay. Oh, here's another one of these. This is for barbarians, though. For all characters on this realm. Okay, yeah, that we can do the days. I need time to do that. Let's get to this dude, then we'll teleport. And then uh, we can always just come back here. useful or not. Oh, I just saw that buff at the bottom says that you get more XP while there's other players nearby. Interesting. Okay, this might this place actually might just have everything that we need. Like waypoints and stuff. Wait, I saw something down here. Hermit's abode. It's just a cellar. Uh, we have plenty of inventory space. The cellars are really short, right? I think. We got separated. Oh, it's the, the same adventurer again. I won't last on my own. We gotta protect him. I need time to do that. Is there no end? So apparently, I do have a way to make them vulnerable. I think it's just on my auto attack. I should probably not fight on top of the... On top of the person I'm protecting, because if they have AoEs... Manage from here. Please take this. All right. Yeah, I guess the sellers are can just have random events in them. Get back to that other town. This also goes to the town. 
Got a silver ore for coming this way. Alright, we got that. Um, let's finish this one quest. We should have inventory space enough for anything he might give us. I see. So our young brother failed in his pilgrimage to the monastery. A shame. But no worse than any of us have earned, is it? Death of fang and claw, of freezing, of the pyre. Our sinful bodies deserve no better. Delightful. Yes, darkness is all around us. Threatening to close in at any moment. It is our struggle to keep it at bay, if only just barely. Back when the Knights Penitent still patrolled these woods, they would construct great sanctified braziers to ward off evil. There is one not far from here. If you wish to help us push back the darkness, you could light it. Okay. Next time we'll grab all the quests that are here, but I just want to go to the blacksmith for now. Do you see now, Black then? Oh, that's enough not the way. Is enough. Parathen soul is marred by sin. No, he wouldn't go that far. You know what must be done, Black then. If you do not do it, all right. We will. Can we just mark all this stuff as do junk? I think we do. To see it through. Actually, we don't need to, because we can just say all, right? Okay. Wait. There's just a level 8 guy running around here? How do you get here so quickly? <laughs> um, so we got two upgrades for that. So we need one more point before we can get to here. So we should probably upgrade something. This lowers the cooldown of that, so I think that's pretty useful. Oh wait, I have another point. Which we can use here. What do we got? Increases your dodge chance. Vanish from sight, gaining an advanced form of stealth. That will not be removed by taking damage. Concealment also makes you unstoppable. Unstoppable is immune. Characters have all crowd control. Crowd have all control impairing effects removed and prevented. It allows you to move freely through enemies. Using an attack skill during concealment will break concealment. Okay, so that's like a everything is going wrong button. It dazes them for four seconds. It seems pretty powerful as well. Poison trap. Arms after 1.25 seconds, it activates when an enemy moves within range, applying... That's a lot of poison damage, but it takes a little bit. Shroud yourself with up to 5 protective shadows, gain 8% damage product, pr reduction per active shadow each time you take direct damage. A damage is reduced and a shadow is consumed. Does it have a certain amount of time that this lasts? Does it just last forever? So if like... If your shadows last for more than 20 seconds, is it just essentially... Like obviously it's not gonna- it's probably not gonna give you- yeah, it says up to 5. So maybe this only gives you one shadow at a time? Not really sure... 
if it gives you all five or if it gives you one at a time and you just keep using it every time it's up. It doesn't seem that... It seems okay. Oh, a 10% chance to not be consumed? That seems a lot better. That's interesting. Huh. I kind of want this poison trap. So you do increased damage to people who are above 80 and below 35. In between there, you do less damage. I kind of want this. Seems cool. Well, we'll have to check out that skill next time. We'll also grab all these uh, quests, like I said. And then we'll continue probably doing these quests and moving towards the main quest, because it's somewhere over here. But anyways, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. Kind of fun. We did our first dungeon, uh, which was interesting. The boss was kind of hard, but we managed to pull through. Either way, hopefully you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.